You ever wish Brawl Stars had daily login rewards? Have you ever wanted to customize your character either to be more tanky or to maybe even deal more damage? Would you like it if you had more abilities than just your attack and a super to actually change the tide of battle? What if I told you there was a fun-filled game that was just as action-packed as Brawl Stars, but also came with all of these perks? You'd probably think I was crazy or something, and you would probably be right, but crazy in a good way. Hey guys, I'm Kairos Time, and it is time for you to join the arena. The Storm Arena. Ah, uh, yeah. Now guys, I have promised in the past that I would be 100% honest with you when I am creating an actual sponsored video. And one of the reasons why I actually don't do them very often is simply because I just... I, I just don't like the games that they try to get me to promote. Seriously guys, my email is filled with a ton of different game developers just reaching out and just saying, hey, will you try this? Will you put it out and stuff? And I'm like, okay. And I always try it out. I always test out the game, but I'm kind of like the Ratatouille guy that when it, talk, when it comes to food, he, if I remember right, he says something like, if I don't love it, I don't swallow. That's right, I have a very refined palate when it comes to uh, games and uh, most of the, most games just just don't just don't do it for me. Now this video is sponsored by Storm Arena and I am actually getting paid for it, but I don't care how much a game company is willing to pay me. If I don't love the game and I think you guys won't enjoy the video, I'm just not going to do it. But that brings me to today's video where we are actually going to be covering some gameplay of Storm Arena. Honestly, from the first 30 minutes of playing this game, I knew that I was going to be doing this video because it was so much fun. I've been playing it for a while now and I think that you guys are going to really like this. It's kind of like a 3v3 MOBA style game, kind of like Brawl Stars is, but it actually has a lot of really fun twists. So get ready to get wet and put your swimsuit on guys we're jumping in the arena the storm arena now some quick information before we jump into the details of this game this game is currently it's just barely released and it is currently in beta testing in ios in canada guys does that does that sound familiar but don't worry if you don't live in canada you can still play just like with brawl stars as long as you have an ios account in canada then you're just fine i mean i don't live in canada and i'm and i'm playing it so yeah you you get the idea also guys in this game they actually have a feature kind of like clubs it's it's kind of like bands in brawl stars um and i st i still have like 40 43 spots open if you guys download the game and jump on as soon as you can, uh, definitely feel free to get a request sent into my Kairos Club. The Kairos, see Kairos. Oh yeah, right there. So that you guys can absolutely play along with me. Also, I'll put a link in the description below so that you can actually get a link to actually download the game. I think probably the best thing for us to do is to just like jump right into a match and cover some actual gameplay. Um, and then I'll actually cover some other aspects of the game that I really enjoy. I'm going to go ahead and start off by playing a Bolt. Um, he's kind of like a really cool tank. Uh, kind of character, and we're gonna be playing some Turf War because that's one match, uh, one game mode that he actually really thrives in. Okay, here we go. We are loading up right here. And now the purpose of this game mode is actually to try to get into the middle. There's this little capture point, um, kind of like capture the flag. And after a while, uh, then we'll be able to actually uh, get in there and um, it starts like a cooldown. So there's there's some ice right there. And if you get caught in the middle, then you actually freeze over and people can actually shoot you. So you kind of like be careful about that. Um, additionally, uh, this is one of the reasons why I like this game so much here. Okay, so we got three different abilities. I'm going to jump in right there. And that's actually like a, an offensive like charge and if it hits the enemy then it actually stuns them oh boy come on come on oh buddy oh he got that he got that shield right there oh and I got caught in the freeze blast that is hilarious so I'm gonna spam that auto aim right there and we're gonna go ahead and uh, to capture capture that flag right there so that now what happens is they actually have to get in here for a certain period of time now I did that just get that 100% that means that my ultimate is actually charged up I'm gonna go over to the side right there and grab that shield there are different perks and stuff on the sides of the maps here we go. I'm just going to wait for that freeze to finish up. And right there, I burst it in there. And then I actually use an ability that lets me go invincible. So nobody can deal any damage to me for a certain period of time. That way, I kind of waste their uh, their abilities. Um, and then my teammates can actually uh, deal a ton of damage to them. Uh, now, let's see here. I want to get... I cannot heal up. Uh, like in Brawl Stars, how you heal up is you... Oh, let's see here. One second. Uh, do, do I not have my super up? There we go. There we go. Oh, it's not. Okay, it's it's you tap it. I forgot. You tap it and then you move to where you actually want to body slam down there. Just I've been playing so many characters, I forget all of their mechanics. This game is a ton of fun. There's there's 12 different characters. They all have different abilities and things like that. Check that out. See, so jump in right there, stun him, deal damage, 
I mean, I've got a I've got a short range shotgun type of uh, a weapon, so I've got a I got to use that stun ability to get in there. Um, now let's see here. I'm gonna okay. There we go. See my ultimate or my my super defense right there allows me to avoid damage and things like that. I'm gonna come over here, grab the shield. Now if I attack while I have this shield, the shield goes down. So I'm gonna use it to try and get uh, sneak up under bushes. Oh man, he saw me or something. Oh man, okay, so he took me out. Um, but so this is this is not fun. As you can see at the very top, we're totally smoking these guys. Uh, we got 64 and they got zero, but they did just take our capture point. So we gotta hurry up right there. Oh, I was saying. Um, in Brawl Stars, if you want to heal up, you just don't attack and you uh, don't take damage. Um, and if you do that, there we go. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, he had the he had the ability right there. There we go. Three HP. But the only way for us to heal up in this game is for us to actually get to a heal um, a heal icon. There's one right here in these bushes. I'm gonna grab that, and I cannot attack while I'm healing up, or it will reset. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna use that right there. Charge in and shotgun them to death. Oh, he used it. He used his his shield, so I couldn't actually deal damage to him. Um, but we gotta we gotta get into the middle right there and actually take that capture point, or we're gonna end up losing here. Uh, we still got we still like twice of as many uh, capture. Oopsies. Oh, I I aimed it at the wrong area. Um, so we're still doing pretty good here. Oopsies. Pay attention, Kairos. Come on, come on. Very good. Now this game does offer. Oh yeah, body slam like that super or that ultimate. I'm gonna call everything wrong in this game or something like that because of Prowl Stars. Uh, now, this game does have auto aim as you can see, but it, I've, I've learned, like I can already tell that you are gonna be much better off if you don't actually auto aim, if you actually learn how to aim uh, manually. Okay, get in there, get in there. Just tanking their damage. I don't know if that's the best decision. I probably should only do that when I have teammates and stuff. But regardless, definitely a high skill. You can use auto aim for your regular abilities or you can aim them just like this. Here I've got my uh, a stun. Oh yeah, going in for the kill. It's And it's super fast gameplay. Like, like that is such fast movement, that charge. I'm gonna use my super right here. It's like this giant body slam comes down right there, stuns both of them, and then I'm able to take them out. And got, uh, got that uh, healing thing right there. Okay, now he stopped his heals by actually dealing damage to him, and we're ready to go. There we go. Okay, he's down. He's down. Whoa! That was intense. That was intense. Okay, getting up all on him. Very good. We're solid. Okay, and with 86 seconds, or with 86 points, we're uh, we're really looking. We're looking just fine right here. I'm gonna finish this guy off. Oh, he actually used an ability to get away. Typically what I've noticed is that each character has their regular attack, a super, uh, or an ultimate, and then they also have their uh, a defensive ability and then an offensive ability. Man, that was a piece of cake right there. We're totally rocking things. If you're playing Brawl Stars and you jump into this game, you're going to be shredding people. I, I, It's just because the skills absolutely do cover over or carry over. And it's a ton of fun. Now, there are four game modes in total, and I will show you the other three. But before we do that, I actually wanted to show you something that I really like about this game that I really wish that was actually in Brawl Stars because it's so cool, okay? If you go down to upgrades right here, you can see these these upgrades charts, this is how you actually progress in the game. Now in the very center, we actually have these skills right here. And currently there are only three, but I imagine in the future they'll actually add more skills. Um, basically energy regain helps you uh, charge up your ultimate faster. Then we have second wind, which gives you a little bit of like an extra shield in those really dire situations. Then you have ammo rush, which helps you recharge your ammo really, really quickly so that you can actually deal a ton of damage with your regular offensive attack. Now on the sides right here, we actually have these different parts. These parts, there's a lot of different kinds of parts Right here. In fact, you can go down and check these out. Like there's there's five different kinds of offensive parts. Now, what I really love about this is that I can actually like switch out my my parts. So like here I've got uh, just plus attack. Let's say I actually want to have some uh, HP and cooldown right there. And then the coolest part right here is here I've got my DPS profile. I also have profiles for tank. As, which really focuses on HP, uh, then also support, which really focuses on decreasing that cooldown time. So I mean, if you wanted to like take your DPS character and make them even more DPS-like, or maybe you actually wanted to like add a ton of speed or something like that so they can move really fast, going kind of like assassin type character. Really what it comes down to is it's your choice and you get to play the characters how you want to play them. And the goal of your progression is to try to get better, bigger, more powerful parts as you progress through there. Now I know some of you guys are saying, just show me more gameplay, 
Kairos. Just show me more gameplay. Here we're going to do that. I'm actually going to show you a little bit of gameplay from Pieces of Eight. Um, and I think I'll switch my character right here. And we're going to go ahead and play Octobomber. He's, he's kind of like a... Well, you'll see. You'll see. Okay, here we go. Now, the goal of this is to try to get 30 coins and survive with all the coins, okay? Um, now, here, I was going to say, he's... He's like a he's like a, a dynamite or a barley in Brawl Stars that can actually like throw over walls and stuff. And the reason why I picked him is so that I could actually deal damage from over here and take out whoever has the most coins. Okay, because the goal is to get 30 coins, and once you have 30 coins, then you have to actually survive for a minute. And if you are able to survive a minute without everybody taking you out with those 30 coins, then uh, then you actually win the match. Now it's really hard. Um, to do that because you got seven other people trying to take you out, but the thing that actually does help out is that you're gonna have um, the coins actually make you a little bit stronger. They're, they give you slightly more HP, a little bit more damage and stuff like that. Uh, so having 30 of them, basically, it's gonna come, come down to a point where you have um, a so much HP and damage that they cannot actually beat you. Okay, come on here. Huh, huh, oh, come on. Oh, take him out. Oh, he went invincible. Come on! Wow, that was intense. Okay, I gotta grab this right here, and I gotta heal up somewhere. Okay. Oh, shoot. Yeah, I really gotta heal up. Okay, I've got my uh, ability. Huh! No, he took it. He took it. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, no! Oh, no, and it took all my coins! Oh, no, he's got 30 coins. Okay, so now you can see that's showing me where he's at. I've gotta chase him down. Oh, my gosh, there's so many people over here. Okay, come on. And not only do I have to chase him down, but I have to grab some coins to try and... Oh, come on. Come on. Die, die, die. Yes. Yes, I got it. Okay, so now I'm going to try and run away. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Grab this HP. Come on. Oh, dodge that. Come on. Okay. Okay, this is intense. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, so I have to survive for 40 seconds with these kind of these guys trying to take me out here. I got that shield. Here's a little bit more HP. Everybody's... It's kind of like a, a struggle between them. Like, are they going to try to chase me? Oh my gosh. Are they going to try to chase me down? Or are they actually going to uh, try and build up their own coins and stuff? Fight each other kind of situation. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's uh, let's see if we can't take them out. Oh man. Oh yes. Oh yes. Even more coins. Even more coins. 15 more seconds. Come on. These guys aren't playing super hot. They're, <laughs> they're struggling. They don't know the OP skills of a, of a Brawl Stars legend here. <laughs> okay, now one thing you will notice is that attacking actually slows down my character a little bit So I don't want to just like straight up attack while I'm running away, but uh, wow Wow solid victory right there guys super solid victory right there now before we show you the other types of game modes that They have in here that are also a lot of fun. Let's go ahead and take a look at the actual characters So there are 12 different characters in here got a, quite a few DPS brawlers But then there are a lot of other really cool uh, characters here as well We also have a couple of support characters. I've played Catitude quite a bit. She's a lot of fun Then we also have a few tanks and stuff Krabby is really fun because uh, he actually has like a grab He throws out his his thing and he pulls a character back and stuff and makes him really really a, a great character to be playing with additionally guys I wanted to show you some cool stuff first of all check out this they have some like events and stuff like that that allows you to actually unlock some free characters just for getting online and actually checking them out on top of that they have daily quests that actually help you progress a little bit further um, you know things like playing with friends okay now we're actually gonna go ahead and show you guys some bounty hunter which is really cool and I've got a really sweet character this is the first character that you unlock and he's a ton of fun okay playing as tech manta here now he's got a regular attack that kind of like just shoots out like that just and he has oh one thing I forgot to mention is that each character has different amounts of um, like ammo so like tech manta he's got two big things of ammo right there um, whereas some characters only have one and some characters have five uh, really unique and cool aspect so this game mode um, is kind of like t who, who can take out the enemy team um, more times than not all that matters here is kills so we're both trying to get to 100 um, and that's 20 to 25 kills or something like that. I don't know all the details, but something like that, which is really cool. Now this is this is really sweet. Oh, that's I died. That's that's not really sweet. Uh, <laughs> but this is cool. This is my favorite combo with Tech Manta right here. Oh, I missed him. I missed him. Come on, take him out. Take him out. There we go. Um, well, here I can actually go into emptiness, and when I'm in emptiness, nobody can deal any damage to me at all. Um, so really sweet. Now let's actually show off his his ultimate. This is really cool. It basically shreds through characters. 
Oh yeah, oh yeah, you see that. And one thing that's interesting is you can actually destroy terrain right here. If I just like attack those boxes enough, then it will destroy it without me having to charge up an ultimate or anything like that. Gotta heal up. Okay, barely made that out there without getting hit. Okay, come on. Okay, here, now I'm gonna silence them. Oh, missed them again, come on. It's actually not a silence, I think it's a stun. Or not a stun. Um, I can't even think right now. I gotta focus, gotta play, gotta win. Okay, we're rocking it. We're rocking things right here. Okay, killed him as well. So this is fun um, in because it's like uh, the goal. Okay, I'm gonna run away from that tank guy. There's gotta be heal. No, there's not heal back here. Come on. Oh yeah. Uh, wow, solid victory right there. That wasn't even hard. That was not even hard. Okay, well, one thing that's fun is that you can actually queue up for all game modes for whichever one is fastest, so that's kind of cool. But we're actually going to go ahead and go into a goal attack right here. It's kind of like Brawl Ball in Brawl Stars, but it's a little different. Okay, here we are. We are in here. Um, now, the reason why this is different is, first of all, check this out. Oh, yeah, regular attack, then it bursts out. Oh, yeah, deals tons of damage. Love this character here. Um, and I can actually uh, cause fear on them, and by fear, it makes them automatically run away. Now, it's different in, than Brawl Ball because you can actually attack, um, you you have to attack the ball to move it. Oh my gosh, come on, Kairos, come on. Uh, okay, I'm gonna haste. No, almost got it in there. Now, I'm actually pushed higher up than most characters, and this game just, just barely released, so I don't actually think that I'm playing against other people. I think I think that these are bots or something like that, but I want to at least show you guys the gameplay. Um, I'm going to use this to this haste to get in here, and we're going to try and uh, score that goal really fast. Oh, yeah, he's just, he's just, oh, oh, yeah, stupid bot, stupid bot. Oh, yeah, now I get to run away because I'm awesome with that sweet haste. Oh, that's fun, that's fun. Okay. Um, I probably better focus on actually like killing these characters and stuff because uh, my my bot friends they are not super great. Let's uh, let's throw down this giant. Oh come on! I'm just gonna throw down my giant hammer thing. I think it's a hammer. It might be a. Um, I've got my 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 ultimate is either a hammer or is it like a compact umbrella or something like that? She uses umbrellas. I'm not sure why. Okay, there we go. We'll throw that down there. It's gonna deal a ton of damage. In fact, we even took him out already. Bah, I already got taken out. Come on, Kairos. Come on. Get to the ball. You can see up at the very top that the ball, it actually shows how close they are to the two different goals. We're slightly, we're basically just in the middle. Um, but let's, uh, let's push up right here. Okay. Pushing that. And... Okay, he's... Wow, got that already. That was awesome. Okay. We're gonna run away now. <laughs> Let's try and take these guys out. We'll send fear. Fear makes them run away, or it's panic. Okay, well, I took one of them out, and my bot friend is just not going to do anything. They're just going to be like, hey, there's a ball that I could try to kick into the into the wall, but, uh, yeah. So, that's one thing that will be really great uh, in the game, was, is once there are more players and things like, or more players to actually jump into the queue, I'm really excited to play this game mode against other players and see how you having to attack the ball actually influences things because that's a totally different feature uh, than is in Brawl Stars. I'm going to use haste and did I make it? Oh, come on. No! <laughs> so close. I can't even win against bots. Though, although I don't have my teammates that are, are here uh, to actually help me out. Ooh, one other thing that's really cool. Check this out. Upper right hand corner, they have different pings and stuff like that. So let's say we want to go on the offense. Attack! Attack or oh no no oh I, I can't spam it that's sad that's sad I wanted to spam it okay let's do it assemble yeah show off the spin there we go <laughs> you get the idea you get the idea even though they were against bots we rocked things guys and that makes me feel good. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you let me know what you thought about it in the section below. And if you have any other games that you think would actually be worth me showing you on the channel, definitely put those in the comment section below. Additionally, feel free to ask me any questions if you do have them regarding Storm Arena. And for now, guys, this is Kairos Time ticking by, and we will see you in Storm Arena.